Hey guys, today I'll today I'll be teaching you how to do the um, particle effect in After Effects. So first of all, what you want to do is you want to create a new solid. You can have any color, but in this case, I'll just be using a white. Now, what you'll want to do is search CC star first, and then you'll click on that, and it'll come up with all of this. So just scatter it a whole bunch as much as you want. I'll do that. I think that looks good. And as you can see right now, the particles are moving and you know it just doesn't look like it fits. So you want to turn down the speed to whatever you want. I mean, pro preferably something really low. So there's only just a slight bit of movement. And you can change the size if you want. I'll just change it to 104. Then you want to add some glow. You can add any glow doesn't have to be a sapphire one but I'm just gonna add it in this case because I prefer sapphire uh, you want to add a Gaussian blur to it just turn that up just a little bit so as you can see there's only a slight difference but it's enough and then I'll add uh, s underscore warp chroma just to give it just a little bit of color not too much as you can see around the edges, it's now got the RGB effect on it. So it will look like this. And as you can see, when it goes to the new, the next clip, it looks kind of strange how the particles are in the exact same spot. So split the white solid and change the phase to whatever you want. I'll have it like this. So it's like that now. So it's like the particles are in a whole new area. And on this scene, or I've just added my own transitions. Um, that I have another tutorial on how to do that. But as you can see, the particles stay in the same place and it looks nice how they're like that. To make it look even better, you can add your own color correction. I'll show you what I mean. Uh, CCs, cool, and as you can see now they have like their own little streaks to it, it looks nice, they stand out more, I'll show you what they look like in the edit. So now that the pretty render is done, I'll show you how it looks with the transitions, the CC, everything. So you stand I, that looks good to me. Uh, if there's any other tutorials that you want me to do, let me know. And I'll try and do them if I can. Um, I'll try to keep this like a weekly thing or every few days I'll make a tutorial. So yeah, hope this helped you and um, peace.